is that? Pull back. guys and welcome it is that srb2 dude here today bringing you yet another episode of the tearing up series where you guys in the comment section below tell me what weapons to use and tear it up with and whatnot now last time we used the explosion which was a much slower more or much slower paced uh type weapon and uh you guys seem to really enjoy it so today we've got a new weapon as uh you guys in the comment section told me to use and all that we are going to be going to head that is not what I was going to press. We are going to be going ahead. <laughs> I'm great at this content stuff, guys. We're going to be using the Emperi Duelies. Now, this is actually a weapon, personally, I have not used for a really long time. It comes with the Curling Bomb and uh, Inkjet. Now, I feel like I'm going to do something a little bit different with this. Uh, I'm going to run Ninja Squids. I mean, I think it's actually something that some people used to run back in the day, but... Not, even, not many people use this weapon now. It's actually pretty insane to think that it's, uh... It's not that it's, like, horrible. It's just that when... Not a lot of people just use dualies. That's just, that's just what it is, I guess. Um, I'm not even too sure what I'm gonna run. Or... I think I'll just run this. And this. I don't know what I'm gonna run for my shoes. That is my, my issue right now. That's what I'm trying to look out for. Maybe I just go with, uh... I might just go with this, just for the curling bomb, since I will be throwing quite a bunch of them out, so... Yeah. Let's go with this build and see what happens, and I shall see you guys in the lobby. Okay, now we have got the eight players. We are gonna go in and see what happens as we go in with these Imperi Duelies. And uh, try to do our best to wreck things and stuff. I don't really know what to say, honestly. But... Other than this weapon is a Slayer weapon, so I'm most of the time I'm going to be going in or going trying to. Go, I'm trying to do my. I'm gonna do my best to try and go in as much as I can, and uh, you know take people out and all that. So it's also one of those things where I don't really use a lot of inkjet weapons. So that's that in itself is a uh, something really different. Ooh. There is a guy. I mean, I, I hit a guy that was over there thinking I have cancer dualies. I just threw. The curling bomb upwards. There's someone actually going down there, and the hydra spiling actually cut me out. Okay. I probably should have just like charged my inkjet there just to see if I can actually snipe that hydra. But I was kind of like, I was pretty hesitant on that, and I'm not, um, I don't really know what to say. Anyways, other than let's try and uh, take this back, I'm gonna try and do my best to build an inkjet to defend and all that. Take, oh, almost took that guy out. Slosher is dead. They have backed up. That's actually the Elia. For whatever reason, I thought that was a, uh, a closer range weapon. I thought it was like a splat charger or something. Uh, I need to really remember that I should uh, probably use my roll more for... Uh, I should use my roll more for... Oh, okay. Should use my roll more for event evasive stuff. Like, if I can actually get a kill, then sick. But, like... I feel the roll really works well when it's, uh, well, really evasive. Oh, okay. I lost track of where that guy was. That was my fault. But I did kind of scare them a little bit, which is perfectly fine with me. Uh, just gonna try and go in. Oh, okay. We're gonna trade with the Elia, which is completely fine. Uh, we're still pushing the tower. I'm actually be going to be able to jump over to my pull point. And... I should be safe. Couple rolls here and there. I'm probably dead now. Um, actually, no, I'm not. I'm okay, now I'm dead. <laughs> if I had moved back, that Hydra would have instantly killed me. So that's why I kind of pushed the tower at that point. So I would have uh, stayed alive. So, you know, it's better to be alive than dead. And as you can kind of slow, like, as you kind of slow, I was like, all right, I'm already dead. Because uh, I thought I was, but that's not true. Well, not true anymore. Oh, that was a trade. Yeah. I only feel like uh, when it comes to dodge rolling, it's definitely a thing where you should only be using it for evasive stuff, or you could use it to roll to uh, take people out aggressively uh, if they don't notice you, or if you have, like, the edge on them. So, like, 
you know, just kind of be careful with, like, how you don't draw, I guess. I mean, in situations like that, then maybe. If my aim was a little better, that would have worked, but I kind of, like, whiffed that a little bit. Uh, bear in mind, this is actually my first game of the day, too, so no warm-up or anything. I'm just going in and seeing what happens. I got him, but the Hydra's still looking at me. I do have armor. I'm going to wait for the ends up. I had to snipe him. I think the soda slusher must have uh, jumped to someone that was uh, further away because I didn't see him come out to spawn, which is uh, a little bit questionable for or for everything. Try to push this. That was a little slow. I mean, I didn't do a dodge roll for that, but I still killed him, so we'll take that. That is two guys here. I'm gonna die to the ink mine. Or the ink cloud. It was like ink cloud there too, so. Um, control has been got. We should be able to get two kills off this. We have loads of map control. Uh, I was gonna say that their comp really lacks aggression. Mainly because they have two backline, but we also have two backline, but I definitely say that the bull point in general. Uh, for a. For a backline weapon, it can be, like, much more aggressive to, compared to, like, uh, a Hydra Splatling, so... Good thing to, I guess, remember there, too. Try and get that kill. There's a guy hiding on my jump. Okay, well, he's not there anymore because somebody took him up. But, he did try the thing. And as you can see, I was not having it. Thank you very much, Armour. I actually would have died if, uh, he actually didn't take that out. Oh, I can take this out. There we go. We're looking for an end zap now. Oh, okay. Well, I'll try and time the curling bomb or something. Maybe might take that guy out, but... Just keep him in the spawn, and we're just gonna win the game just like that, so... Fairly good, fairly easy game, honestly. I mean, the start was a little weird, but... We pretty much took it back and then held the... Well, basically held everyone else in their spawn. So... Pretty good game to start off with. And uh, with that, I shall see you guys in the next lobby. Alright guys, so we have got another lobby. And should mention, the rotation has just changed. So we're in we're playing Rainmaker now. And uh, luckily, uh, the maps are really good for us. We got two pretty long maps for Rainmaker, so hopefully there is no situation where I run into... My entire team dying, and then basically we just lose off that. Because <laughs> the map is just really small. Shouldn't that be a thing? Now, let's see what we can do here. We might be able to get the first pop. If uh, we shoot the Rainmaker enough. Yep, nice one, guys. We got the map control. I'm going to attempt to actually try and flank. I don't know. Yeah, that, that I, I had a feeling that there was actually a guy, like, just sitting there and in a... Uh, Trying to get something out of that, but... Also, situation where a dodge roll actually works pretty well. Oh god. Oh, I almost killed him. Well, I had the aim on him, so... That would have been a really good situation for us. If I had hit that. But, uh, also what I was saying. Uh, remember that dodge roll? Yeah, that was, that's, that's one of those situations where... where you kind of want to use a dodge roll. Or you can use a dodge roll and it just works out pretty fine. Because there's like... No way for them to suspect that you're going to dodge roll there. Oh, I am taking heavy damage here. Oh, I got sniped. Dang it. Had I survived, I would have killed the Rainmaker, but I got sniped. Hoping for him to miss. I got his, like, I, I need to make this more of a thing where I do respect uh, charges accuracy, because a lot of the time I don't, and I really feel like I should uh, more often than usual. I definitely feel like that's Ladder shot? Whoa, okay, no, there's two guys down there. That's not what I was expecting. I was expecting, like, more people to be on the right, but there's two guys coming out of the spawn. Okay. Well, this is a problem here. I'm gonna... Oh, I'm not gonna be able to roll out of that, but... This is a problem right here. We're not having... We're not really getting a lot of opportunity to actually, like, do anything. I'm gonna stop the Rainmaker, at least. I mean, I'm pretty surprised since they do have a, uh, there's a guy right here. 
they do have an Elia, which, you know, I wouldn't say it's the greatest weapon on this map, especially for Rainmaker. It can be very difficult to really make work. But, you know, pretty, pretty surprising, nevertheless. Uh, there is a guy that just came out to spawn. It's a spider shot. I just don't know exactly. There he is. I'm gonna get the trade at least. We're fighting like a... This is a I guess we're fighting kind of a weird situation here. I'm gonna be able to jump at least. But we're trying to make things happen, which is good for us. That Booyah Bomb, I'm gonna survive it, just barely. I'm not gonna be able to lead my Rainmaker out of here, which is gonna be unfortunate, but... I'll throw a Curling Bomb. Okay, no, 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 I can't challenge that, no way. I'm actually kind of lucky that, uh... That I do have Ninja Squid, because that way, that, uh... What's it called? Oh, gotta kill this guy. Okay, I killed him. But, I'm lucky that I had Ninja Squid, mainly because... Oh, I wanna roll up. I got... Mainly because I was able to escape that guy who used Inkjet. Uh, that Dynamo is actually the last guy alive. I wanna try and take control of the right side. I kinda wanna bring the Raymi to the right side, because I feel like... It's just going to be more of a struggle to actually get the Raymaker pushing through the left, unless, like, we've got a bunch of people dead. Oh no, I missed those shots. I didn't want to roll up that, because uh, it might have been pretty awkward. But I, I really don't feel like we should be pushing left. I don't think... Uh, left on this map can be really good if you have a Stingray, but we don't, so... It's only going to make things a lot harder to really do anything. Okay, so, as you can see, the other team is pushing the correct way, which is what I would like. Oh, roll over. It's just the Raymaker alone, okay. He's gonna die for sure. Oh, okay, no, 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 no. He went for the full defense there, but I still, I mean, I still killed him at least. There's probably a guy hiding here. We're moving to the right, finally. Well, we're looking to move to the right. Okay, no, no. I should have waited. I got impatient with that. Which is a bit unfortunate. Hopefully the booyah. No, we literally have not done anything in this match, unfortunately. We gotta get it popped. Uh, I don't think we're gonna really get the opportunity to pop it, unless I do something about that. I had to roll for it, because the, the Elite had his laser on it too, but, you know, maybe it was too predictable for her roll for it. But we really didn't do anything in that game, as a team. As a team, we couldn't do anything. Yeah, I tried to push up, but I couldn't do any. We just couldn't do anything. So, let's just see you guys in the next lobby. Alright, we've got another game on... This tearing up episode. It's gonna be Raymaker again. This time it's gonna be on Sturgeon Shipyard. I would arguably say it's uh, also a really good map too. Uh, I'm just hoping that we have a composition that, you know, wants to work together and, uh, you know, acts a little bit more active. I mean, we've got a pretty decent, I mean, we've got a pretty good composition, I would say, right now. If I say so myself. Uh, there is a guy on the right side. He might have just moved out the way. Oh no, that high is just watching me. Oh! Okay, no. That guy did. Well, I think that was the guy that was looking at me, but. Either way, he's dead now. And we do have control of the middle of the map, so that is great for us. And we can get some stuff done. Now, use my ninja squid to advantage. That guy got booped by a uh, slosher that had the. Uh, slosher that had the baller. There is a Hydra Splatling somewhere. I don't know exactly where he is, honestly. <laughs> I'm actually trying to look for him. Oh, he's over there on the right side? Okay, well... I'm actually just gonna go all the way to the top right. I couldn't actually find where exactly he, where he was, which is... Uh, which would have been favorable in my case, but... Roll 
roll. I couldn't roll there, unfortunately. I was also being chased by a guy behind me, and I didn't want to, like, turn around just yet, because, uh, I might have died, obviously, so. But let's try and get them thing done here. Oh, yeah, I'm gonna attempt to get something done, at least. The Raymaker, for whatever reason, is losing a lot of time. Oh, I couldn't roll out of that situation, but the Raymaker's gonna pop. And he's not gonna be able to take the lead off that, so... Good for us in, us, in that situation. But the Raymaker is in our core area. And... No, 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 that's not gonna happen. No, 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 no. Tried to take it through the sponge. If you get it through the sponge on this map, you can get a huge amount of points. And, uh, it can be all kinds of bad, especially if it comes to... You know, all, you know, the points being on the other side, I guess. Yes, thank you very much. I'm looking for the spider shot. Uh, I traded with him. I had a feeling that he was still near me, but like, I felt like he might have pushed back and then he didn't, so. I should have just stuck to my feeling, basically. That's what the problem was there. Now, I'm not too sure about this. Oh, then the curling bomb didn't reach. It's no matter, I can get up there with the sponge. I am kind of sabotaging my teammate there. Should be okay, though. I would love if I had a... I'm not going to be able to challenge this. I would love if I had my inkjet in that situation, because then I would have been able to actually contest and maybe go to a couple kills there. Uh, but there is a guy coming here. He's going to lose armor. Oh god. Oh my god. I, does he know I'm here? No, he doesn't. Okay. He didn't know I was there, which was perfect. Uh, the Hydra is dead. That's a triple for us. Everyone is in spawn. Oh god. No, 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 no. Ah. I had my inkjet ready to... I was gonna go ahead and use it, but like I didn't have like... I felt like I was gonna straight away die to the, uh, the torpedo, and that's something I just didn't want, so. Either way, we're gonna get back in here. Might be able to go for a flank here. Take that K-Pro, and your, all your evilness. Take that guy out. Oh, okay, we won up that. Well, we should have won up that, nice. Alright. <laughs> Interesting game there. Got things done, and uh, we won. So, that was only the third game, I believe. That was only the third game, dang. That's actually pretty interesting. No ink jets, dude. Come on now. I gotta get some. I gotta get my special or something. <laughs> or use it. Anyways, so see you guys in the next lobby. I'll use it for the next round. Okay, guys. Here we are yet again with another game of Rainmaker. We've had quite a bit of map variety in this episode. And now we're going to have another chance at Black Valley Skate Park. Now, hopefully, I'm hoping that we... I mean, well, actually, no, I think this is, this is probably going to be a decent team. I think. I hope. We do have a Hydra. And, you know, from what I saw from the past games, I don't know if this is... I, I believe it's the same Hydra that was in our last games, but... Well, from what I saw from the last games, they were trying to do their best to hold their own, which I can get behind at least. Now, that Dooley Sculpture is trying a thing. Okay, he's coming. Oh, that Ink Rush is weak. Oh, 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 oh. Roll out of here. Honestly, Inkjet. These missiles are kind of everywhere, but the Inkjet is uh, just defending. I didn't exactly see the Tetris that was uh, right in front of me. I'm just gonna go for the defense. Oh my god! All right, <laughs> I almost thought I was gonna get a triple there, but I mean that was probably the best play to go out with that because uh, you know I had really good defense and all that, and you know uh, we're still in the game at least. Now I'm just gonna honestly like I'm, I'm just gonna have to shoot this. The Tetris is gonna scoot in five points which i'm not happy about at all that guy's gonna jump out perfectly fine with that gonna move back 
don't like any of this right now. Like we have no control. We were just we're just struggling here. Gonna send out missiles. I guess we'll just this will just be to move them back. We will let the Raymaker reset in the middle of the map, which is uh, you know probably the most favorable thing for us. They're going back. To, to, they're gonna try and do something right again. Get that guy out of here. Ah oh, no! I should have waited. I'd have been a little bit more patient. That guy would have just died. Well, I would have been able to easily kill the Raymaker since he was alone. But I felt like I had to instigate as well, but, you know, how this game is going, it does not look like that's happening. I mean, we, well, we now got a pretty favorable matchup since they all just died in this situation now. Okay, but... Oh, he has te Tetris, obviously. I should have realized that since they have two duallys, so they're, obviously they're going to be able to roll out. Alright. Well, let's try and make something happen out of this game. I mean, it doesn't look... It, uh, it don't look too good. I'll let you guys know that. I mean, we've got some sort of control. Well, let's let's get something going, at least. Might be able to get the lead off this, actually. Alright, I'm gonna, like, hard defend this. Watching the front. Get out of here, guys. New sheriff in town. It's called Deadass RB2, dude. Unfortunately, we can't get- we shouldn't go this way. Oh my god, no. It's just the brush versus the sploosh right now. We're in such a- this- why did he bring it left? Because if he had brought it right, we probably would have actually got the lead up there. That's another two kills for us. The last two are right in front of us too, so... Opportunity here. I'm actually going to pick it up this time. Where we're going to go is a mystery right now. <laughs> it is a mystery. Well, we have already killed two, which is perfect. If you can keep contain the lost guys, wherever the duelies go... Oh, no, they, they killed everyone. Okay, see? Going right. If we went right the first time, we would have got all these points. All right? Plus, if, they, we, got the, if we went right the first time, we would have popped the Raymaker possibly on the... Well, on this platform here too, so it is all working out now. All right, that's good. That was a good game. I'm glad that uh, at least we have redeemed ourselves from Blackberry. I mean, personally, I don't really think I did too much other than like pick the Raymaker up a couple times and defended it when it was necessary. I feel like I could have done a couple things better, but you know, either way, we still won the game. You know, we actually held it. We held our own. With that, I shall see you guys in the next lobby. Okay, guys. We got another game coming in. Uh, we have had a total of... Four games? That should have been... The last game was should have been the fourth one. This is going to be our fifth game. Uh, using the Empery Duelies right now. So, let's try and get another good one under our belts. And uh, try to slay out a little bit more. Interesting composition that we have. They have also a pretty interesting comp, so... Let's, uh, you know, let's get, a, let's, let's get two wins on, uh, you know, when oh, this guy's trying to boo you. Oh, snap. All right. They popped it real fast. Should have realized they have a sploosh. We also have a sploosh, but, oh, they have a sploosh at 52 and a charger, so there's no wonder we didn't even get it. Or well, it wasn't even close, more or less. I'm gonna go for the roll. They only got it to 59 points. Not so bad, honestly. This guy has a hammer. Oh! I'm out of it, dude. I don't want any of this. This man really trying to get me. Uh, not, not gonna happen. Not gonna happen. Yo, if we can let it reset, perfect. Uh, that guy is still in this bus. You got him. Easy. Alright. Just gonna try and... Uh, or just going to uh, attempt to assist with that, but... Doesn't matter. Gonna try and push these guys back with the inkjet. No, I didn't want to die to that 52. I mean, we still killed them. And we still have a pretty good amount of control. Also, they've actually, uh... They've also used this... Uh, what do you call it? They used their Stingray pretty early. Oh. Okay, I got two. I didn't get the third. 
but I did get two just to slow them out a little bit, so now they're going to be facing a 2v3 situation unless they get jumps. I doubt they'll get jumps, but uh, there is a guy here. Oh my god, really? We just, we just kind of died? Oh. Ah, uh, I got hit. But I'm alive. That's what we're gonna take from that. I'm alive. I'm just gonna, like, slowly push this man away. Alright, can we, like, get in a favorable... I guess, favorable position so we can actually get something going? The 52 is back here. I feel like that injured may have helped a little bit. We tried to push it left again, guys. Like... Gotta understand, you can't go left on this map unless you have a Stingray. Right. Oh god. I'm gonna die to that Stingray. Speak of the devil. <laughs> like, we should not be try- we should not try to go left. It's like way too narrow. It's easy for the- it's much easier for them to defend. So, let's try to go right next time, please. Otherwise, we're not gonna win. No, I was actually kind of like, worried about that. Okay, thank you very much. There, that guy is now dead. Should I pop the Raymaker? I should. I'll, 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 I'll give it a head start. But I don't want to be going this way. I'm just going to use my Inkjet to kill this guy out. And his friends. Oh, hopefully his friend. No, we're going right again. Okay, fine, I'll try to assist you. Try. Ooh, we got the kill though. Okay. There's just a lot of problems when it comes to going this way on Rainmaker, which I don't particularly like too much, but... Hey, we got lead now. <laughs> we got something going, so... 47? I mean, on this platform here, you get it to like 42. I mean, it's it's better than not winning right now, but... Uh, we still... I guess it's, You know, you can get more points going, right, basically. A lot easier. I'm literally just gonna wait right here. This guy's gonna pop up. There we go. Get an easy kill there. Just pick him off. Oh! Come on. Thank you. Jesus, that took, like, longer than it needed to. But I did t I did- I did kill him. That's the great thing about that. That sploosh is, uh, a little questionable, I must say. He also does a hammer. He did have a hammer, but now he does not, which is great. The hammer has been taken out. We can actually consider going this way again. Uh, 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 uh. The best thing about that is that I'm alive. They do have a Stingray. It's coming in for defense, but, you know, at least they burst. They wasted two specials off it. That's perfectly fine for us. We actually might be able to get deeper in this one, which at this point, I'd say, yeah, might as well. well might as well, since uh, we're in this one. I mean, actually, we don't... We probably shouldn't. They're all, like, trapped in their spawn, so... You know, just move back. Okay. I was gonna consider moving deeper into the spawn if, uh... I mean, I guess if we were... I mean, if if the enemies weren't actually already spawning in and coming in, then maybe we could have gotten a couple more points, and that could have been justified, but we... You know, maybe it was probably safer just to, like, remove the Raymaker and just go further back. But either way, shall see you guys in the next lobby, which will be the last one. Okay, guys, this is going to be the very final game. Hopefully we get Sturgeon Shipyard just to give us some map variety, but instead we're going to get Black Belly Skate Park, which I guess. <laughs> Not really much we can do. Uh, don't really have too much power when it comes to choosing maps and all that. You guys better move. Get a move on. Alright. That's always the worst thing you, you don't want to see. You don't want to see a game start and your teammates just don't move at the very start. It's just like big Monka S vibes. Now, let me tell you what about what is uh, going to be questionable. As if we get starts like that. Oh, the last two guys are right here. Okay, well, easy takeoff for that one. 
person's trying to flank. I'm not gonna let that happen. One of us has got to pick up that Rainmaker, guys. Whether it be the guy that's in a swarm or we're just gonna let it reset. Oh, I got killed by the... The Pirate. It's an interesting name. Aerospray, I see you, you're in this, you're in the enemy swarm painting that base, but we gotta play a little bit more Rainmaker, not Turf War. Thank you very much. Alright, there is a guy in the middle of the map. I'm gonna try and do their very best to try and stop this, as well as I am. Oh, it's gonna be a trade there. There is also a guy on the middle of the map again. Uh, we might have to do something about that. Have we used Stingray? We must have. I mean, if that's the case, we do have a... Probably more justified to actually try to go to the left side. But somebody's got to pick that up. Come, follow me. Follow me. All the way. We're actually protected here. I'm just watching our backs. The Octobrush is trying to do something. We really just gonna win off that? Really? <laughs> That's still gonna be the push that wins. Okay. <laughs> that was a very strange game. That was a very, very strange game. Like, in... Like, for what we were doing that entire game, that was... That game didn't really make much sense to me, but... Hey, we won. And I shall see you guys in the plaza. Okay guys, so here we are, back in the plaza. We had our Tearing It Up episode with the Empery Duelies. Coming out of my comfort zone because mainly, like, with close range duelie weapons. Uh, it's just something about them that makes me feel really awkward. Like, I don't... Uh, it's... Obvi I mean, obviously it could just become... It could just come down to not practicing enough with them. But, uh... I guess, like, it's just a thing where I just... It's, again, it's, I just need to play a little bit more just to be able to get used to it. Uh, I mean, I, I normally, you know, specialize in support weapons and all that and whatnot, but I can also flex, you know. I can use some slayers and I could possibly use a charger. I used to I used to be a charger main when I started playing this game, so uh, yeah, that was a thing. But anyways, uh, that is going to be the episode, guys. Thank you very much, everyone, for watching. If you did enjoy this video, please like, favorite, comment, and subscribe to the channel. And if you have not already, follow me on Twitter and Twitch, both in the description below. Do it for both of your fee and generous. Be sure to hit the bell notification button to let you guys know whenever I do upload a video. And also consider joining my public Discord, which is in the description below, where you can go ahead and talk to myself and my Dude Society community. Thank you very much, everybody, for watching. This video is probably going to be going out when I'm in this video. Uh, Splatoon land in Germany, Rising Squid land, uh, two. And, uh, make sure to hit, leave a comment in the comment section below to let you guys know, or to let me know, not you guys, but me, uh, when I... T just let me know what weapon I'm using next, guys, basically. Just write in the comments. Thank you very much, everyone, for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed. It's been the SRE2, dude, and I shall see you guys in a future video.